Lockheed Martin demonstrated an F-35 fighter jet cockpit at the Teletronics facility in Newtown Township this week. I'm Rachel Canelli, and that's the focus of this week's Buzz in Bucks. This one's in the nose. These are all around the airplane, and it looked at it, and you just switched it for you. Instead of you having to take your thumb and move that picture all over, it does it for you. It's kind of your other person doing that work for you. These fifth generation capabilities are absolutely vital for our services. Um, those capabilities have to do with the aerodynamic performance of the airplane, the state-of-the-art weapon systems and mission systems, the communications gear that allows the airplane not only to talk to the other F-35s, but the rest of the, uh, the combatants that are in the battle space. And then lastly, of course, the all-important stealth piece of the airplane. We've tried to make it so that it's, I think, ridiculously easy to fly. And what that means is that the guys, the worker guys, the guys in the services, they can now concentrate on the mission, on the bad guys, on the targets, on the threat, on command and control, and they don't have to worry their little heads about will the aeroplane crash every time I take off and land. It's the difference between a, a Model T Ford and a modern Corvette. It, it's that difference. It's an absolute game changer. As we all see, the threat in the world is not going away. Uh, there are other countries that are coming up with uh, just as equal impressive uh, aircrafts. So it's very important for us to maintain our air superiority and continue developing product that is going to keep us in elite. This airplane is essentially the next generation of capability at the last generation's price. Um, and the capability will enable our pilots to deal with the, the threats of today, the threats that are, will be just around the corner tomorrow, and the threats of the future for the next 50 years. Well, as I'm sure some of the other test pilots learned, I found out that it's harder to land the plane than it is to take off. So I don't know if I'll be flying any real jets soon, but I did get two bad guys. Reporting from Teletronics in Newtown Township, for the Bucks County Courier Times and Intelligencer Newspapers, I'm Rachel Canelli, and that's the Buzz in Bucks.